And Brooksville has some real charm to it. Last hour, Sarah Finney showed us the mermaid tour through downtown. Well, I found one of the last stops on that tour, the Coney Island Drive-In, where you'll find world-famous hot dogs, a lot of interesting memorabilia on the walls, and even a little Elvis. Well, more than a little. All that bread, Mark, Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Bread. The lobster bread. World famous. Yes, sir. All right, good deal. It's two hours before the doors open at the Coney Island Drive-In, and owner Carter Lee is ready for anything. Everyone always thinks that he's, like, so much older because he acts so much older. He's just 22, and Carter's dad, John, was the original owner of Cody's Roadhouse, a popular chain here in the Bay Area. The apple didn't fall far from the tree here. To be honest, we never heard of it before we bought it. We sold some alligator stools to the guy that owned it. We came down here and we said, this is great. If you ever want to sell it, give us a call. And he gave us a call and it was just the right time. That's an origin story if I ever heard one. But this fits him well. Carter estimates he sells a quarter million foot-long hot dogs a year here. We're going to nail the foot-long hot dog every single time. And there's something else they get right, too. Most of the things you see in here, people gave us. It's not really a restaurant. It's more like a museum. And supposedly Elvis even ate here. And I always thought, man, this story doesn't really add up. But I did finally have a lady who was a wiki mermaid, and she said that she had a very personal relationship with Elvis, and she swears he came here. Well, she'd know, right? Tall tale or not, Carter's all in, with memorabilia and even a weekly show by an Elvis impersonator. He's a sweetheart, yeah. but I, I don't have a crush on him. <laughs> I got my eyes set on Carter. The menu is as big as the King's number one singles. But I think the best things you'll find here aren't on your plate. We go to a lot of chains nowadays, and the friendliness is gone. And that's what we do here. We welcome everybody. We tell them goodbye. We tell them come again. We see them out in the street. We tell them to come on in. Now, guys, I went with the traditional footlong with coney sauce. That's a mild meat sauce, a little kick to it. Diced onions, mustard, served <laughs> with homemade salt and vinegar chips. And yes, my best friends back home have endlessly harassed me for these pictures, but I don't care. We put the camera down so I didn't get relish all over.